What up, boy? Welcome to another episode of BTEC Productions, where today we're going to go over how to use the volume feature that has just been introduced, probably maybe an update ago, maybe like two, three weeks ago, something like that. My name is B, and we can get right into it. But first, let's roll that intro. <laughs> already know the first thing that we do is we that's right we share our screen and i have a clip pulled up here so basically let's listen to this um first all right this is a test test can you hear the music can you hear the music all right, so obviously you heard music in the background. What this voice isolation feature does is, I mean, it's pretty self-explanatory. It isolates your voice um, as best as it can. I saw this actually used in like a mall where they were conducting an interview and I'm talking about gone. It sounded like they were in a recording booth. That's crazy. So we're gonna see how well it works and we're gonna go from there, okay? So we're gonna start at the beginning of the clip um, over here. And then we're gonna go to our volume right here. And we're gonna click on voice isolation. So we're gonna click that. And when it starts out, I think it starts out at like 50%. So let's hear it now. All right, this is a test, test. Can you hear the music? Can you hear the music? All right, so you could definitely hear the music still. So we'll go here. Let's crank it up to 75%. All right, this is a test, test. Can you hear the music? Can you hear the music? You can hear less of the music and more of myself. Kind of get that computery, robot-y type of voice. Let's hear it at 100%. Okay, I changed it. Siri. All right, this is a test, test. Can you hear the music? Can you hear the music? So, as you can hear, so that was 100%. Let's hear it one more time at 0%. All right, this is a test, test. Can you hear the music? Can you hear? So, yeah, man. Um, yeah. I feel like it definitely helped it out a lot. Um, you do start to get some of that computery, robot -y, robotic type of uh, sound. Um, but if you're in a pinch and you're in like the street, you hear like a lot of horns and everything like that. And this is the only thing that you have. You can definitely hear the difference for sure. Um, so let me know is this something that you're kind of like excited about what other features do you want to see final cut pro um add in let me know if this is something that you use already all right we'll see you in the next video